Nathan, I guess from your point of view, nice to, to get a new contract till the end of the season? Yeah, definitely. Um, delighted. I mean, <coughs> obviously, the last injury, not, not being a major one like, like I'm used to, but um, it, it came at a time, we, we, um, the timing wasn't great, to be fair. And um, I mean, obviously, I want to come in here and, and I'm just happy that I've got a chance to um, prove, prove to the management, prove to the fans and that, that I can stay fit and I can... Um, Sort of repay them, repay them with good performances. So yeah, that's what I'm looking to do. Yeah, I mean, it must have been something that was on your mind, and obviously, you know, concerned about your future and where it might be. Now you know at least you've got that security till the end of the season, and and to go and get a new contract at the end of that, the incentive is there. Yeah, definitely. That's that, that's all I really ask at the moment. To be fair, to just get a chance to do that, and um, like the gaffer said, he's he's always um given me the chance to play, and um, I've always had a, had a fair crack when when I when I've been fit. So. Um, mm. Um, yeah, there's, there's no better place to, to be at the moment, definitely. Yeah, I mean, injuries obviously just part of football, aren't they? But obviously you feel you've had your fair share already. Yeah, yeah I know. It's, I mean, it's about time for a good few years without any, I think, for me. And I think I've had my um, my career's worth. But no, nah, um, yeah, they, they happen to everyone. It's just, um, I think, the the severity of, of the ones I've had before has just obviously given me that sort of name, if you like. Um, but yeah, I think I'm, I'm definitely past them now. And... Um, <clears throat> just happy to, to be back fit. Yeah, does that bother you when you maybe get tarnished with that, that brush, or that sort of thing over your head that you're, you, you, you've you carried injuries in the past, or do you just tend to get on with your game and not worry about that? Um, no, you've got, you've got to get on with it, really. Um, I mean, if you do sit and think about it, like I've said before, you you do end up getting getting injuries again, do you know what I mean? So um, you do have to get it get it off your off your mind and just and just concentrate on your game. So, yeah, I don't really let that bother me too no, much. No, at least you were able to play against Manchester United. It must have been a great day. Yeah, um, I mean, for me and probably for most of the boys, it was it was probably the highlight of my career, definitely. Um, <clears throat> playing against the likes of Di Maria Falcao and, that, and um, managing to get his shirt as well. So, yeah, I was happy with that. But um, no, no, it, it was a great night. I mean, I think our tactics were, were, were spot on. Um, <clears throat> I think we um, we were the better team in the first half, if, if I'm honest. Uh, just a, a touch of class by Herrera, I think, kind of killed us. But... Um, after that, I mean, <clears throat> obviously they caught us on the counter when we was when we was all pushing everyone forward. So these things happen, but no, it was a great night. Yeah, you got Falcao's shirt then. So where's that at home then? Is it, if you got that framed? Not yet, but um, I think that's what's going to happen. Yeah, I'm probably gonna, probably going to frame it definitely. Yeah, have you got a place in mind then where it's going to go above the mantelpiece or anything? Yeah, probably probably in my room. I reckon probably in my room. Yeah, keep it in there just to, as a little reminder. I think. Yeah, I mean, it's it obviously you say you all played well in that in that game. What's your one overall abiding memory from that day, though, experience wise, playing against Manchester United? Um, probably watching Herrera's goal go in. If I'm honest, I mean, it happened so quick, and he just um, he just did it on a turn, almost in in one motion. So. Um, it kind of um, made me realise the difference in, in sort of quality bet between them and us. And I mean, it was it, it was different class, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it must give you great confidence of the way that you play going into the Barnsley game. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think a game like that can um, can really boost a team like us, um, boost our season. Um, I think that's given us a lot of confidence. And um, even from, from training and that, I think the boys have looked sharp since then. And... Um, yeah, I think we can definitely press on now. Yeah, because ar arguably this game against Barnsley uh, just as big, if not bigger, than Manchester United, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, with where we are in the league, it's, it's, it's definitely a massive game. And um, we need, <clears throat> obviously, a couple of wins to, to take us out of that relegation zone. But, um, yeah, no, I feel like we're, we're more than capable of it. I mean, the group of lads that we've got are um, really hard-working, good, like, good players. So, um no, I definitely think we've got more than enough ability to do that. Yeah, what do you expect from Barnsley? I mean, they're not that far ahead of you in the table, so it's a big game from their point of view as well. Yeah, they'll they'll definitely be um definitely be at it as well. It'll be um it'll be a dogfight type of game, but um I reckon we're um we've definitely got the quality to to beat them to turn them over. Yeah. Yeah, and, and the venue itself it should looks like it should be a, a good venue to play at as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. stadium and is nice and um. Yeah, just looking forward to it now. Yeah, I mean, these games, I suppose, arguably now as well, as you come in after Christmas, they become more and more important each game, don't they? Because they're running out. Yeah, getting obviously closer and closer to the end of the season, less games to obviously bring it back. So the earlier we can get a, a good run of, of wins going, then the better. Your fair share of injuries, um, but I also understand the in recent months you managed to dish one out as well to the physio. <laughs> to the physio, yeah. Yeah, he's, I mean, he's... <laughs> He managed to make me feel as guilty as possible for that as well. But obviously, with all he's done for me you know, over the years, but um, yeah, I just just caught him late in training, I think. But um, no, nah, there was there was no malicious 
Und das ist ein Zentner. 